And first tonight at 11 o'clock, new information about that shooting outside a football game at Ben Davis High School last week. Police say the 18-year-old arrested in that case admitted to firing a gun, claiming self-defense. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Debbie Knox. And I'm Lindsay Eden. Bob is off tonight. In court documents, David Tillman said he shot the victim in the arm on accident when he was firing warning shots. CBS 4's Courtney Crown took a closer look at those documents. She joins us live in the newsroom now. And Courtney, what have you learned so far? Well, Lindsay, court documents show the school district's police chief actually saw the suspect fire a semi-automatic handgun several times in the direction of a crowd outside of Gate 3. That's according to those documents. Youth advocates say this incident is a symptom of a greater issue concerning children right here in Indianapolis. Scary moments outside of Friday's Ben Davis Carmel football game at Ben Davis High School. According to court documents, school administrators were trying to get a crowd out of the football stadium and school police came for backup. Then police say 18 year old David Tillman fired shots in the direction of this crowd. Court documents say Tillman fired warning shots at the victim in quote self defense. It's still concerning whenever uh, we have shots fired at a high school football game that results in uh, someone receiving a gunshot wound, especially a teenager. Violence in Indy impacts everyone, regardless of age. So I think uh, the young people all feel like uh, somebody's out to get them, that they're not safe. Our young people don't feel safe. Period. Sharday um, Hoskins is the lead youth resource coordinator for the city's Office of Public Health and Safety. Much of her time is spent with students, and she says this idea of on site is a pressing issue among teens. It's on site is just the next time I see you, it's going to be issues, right? Unfortunately, Hoskins says some kids feel like they need guns, and we need to address why. They really feel like they have to. Uh, one, because other people have them, and how can you protect yourself against? something that you don't have one also, uh, but then um, always feeling like there's somebody out to get them. Hoskins urges adults to be a trusted mentor for kids and someone to keep an eye on their social media. To them it seems nosy, right? But for you, it's you figuring out who are their friends. So if there are issues going forward, you know, well, I know he hangs out with these three names, so maybe I can try to contact them, or uh, maybe you find out that they are having a problem. The district says one person involved in this shooting is a former Ben Davis student. The others involved are not current students. Counselors were available to all students in the district today if they needed additional support. Reporting in the newsroom tonight, Courtney Crown, CBS 4 News.